Hi there everyone, in this video I'm gonna show you how you can recall or unsend your message in Outlook. And not only that, we're also going to cover step by step other terms and conditions associated with it. So if you are looking to quickly recall it, let me show you the step in first chapter, which is pretty straightforward. All you need to do is you need to go to send item and then you need to look for the message that you would like to recall. For example, this one. Now I'm going to double click on it and then let's go here and click on these three dots and click on action. Now click on this option, recall this message. Now you're going to see these two options, which is asking us either we would like to simply delete it or you want to update your message. So such that the receiver see the updated message. Now that totally depend on you. Uh, you can choose anyone and then based on your requirement you can choose but right now I just want to unsend my message so I'm gonna keep everything as it is and let's click OK and there we go you have successfully unsent or recall your message but it might be successful or not because there are so many terms and conditions applied with this recall message first and foremost you need to be in same organization for this recall function to work Right now I am using live.com and if I am trying to recall my Gmail from receiver which have ID in Gmail, it will not work period. Also one may question why you are using Outlook Classic, why you are not using the new Outlook. Again the recall feature currently doesn't exist in new Outlook client. So if you are wondering why I am not seeing this feature, then please make sure that you are using Outlook Classic. And of course, I am hoping and praying that your receiver have not opened your message yet because if he have already opened and then you are recalling this later, then it doesn't make any sense. Then in that case, you know, uh, the value of recall is gone. And if this happen with you quite often, then I would suggest you to, you know, schedule your messages or you do delay sense as that, you know, you have option to cancel it or you can change it with time so that's all guys from my side in this video hope that you find this video helpful informational if so then please make sure you subscribe to technoholic plus where we cover various productivity topics so if you are new to this make sure you subscribe and i will catch you with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye